What's happening everyone and welcome back, back into a brand new season and this one is shaping up to be a very exciting one. So we took a break from YouTube at the end of 22, enjoy Christmas. Uh, ever since the start of January we've been really sitting down, working hard on new plans for this year and I can promise you we got some big plans in place. Things are starting to look really up, uh, very exciting, going to be quite a few changes leading into this year. Uh, which we'll be getting into very soon. Yeah, I just wanted to start the year out from when we actually got back on track. So just a couple of days ago, we went to Driftland with Katie Customs and Stuart from Driftland gave me a loan of his practice car. We went there with Jack and Connor Shanahan. It's good to get a bit of tandem seat time with the guys. We went from there, I flew straight back to Ireland and then we went up to Watergrass Hill with the S14.9. Give that one last run, just shaking everything down to make sure the steering is absolutely perfect and I'm really impressed with how this car steers. Very happy with the new Wisefire front steer kit and uh, you'll be able to see that in action here as well. So firstly we'll go to Driftland, then into Watergrass Hill and then I'll be uh, showing you guys a couple of things that we're working on in the workshop and talking about the plans coming up in the near future. So yeah, definitely exciting times. Um, it's been a while since uh, we've been vlogging but... Um, yeah, I plan to show you a lot of what's going on this year, especially with the new plans. So I'm uh, excited to share it all with you and uh, bring you along for the ride. So, hope you enjoy this. Let's uh, jump straight on over to Driftland. Today's machine up here at Driftland. Stu was kind enough to let me borrow his E36 winter drift car, which is competing in the KD Customs winter battle series. Uh, we're up here with Jack and Connor. Connor is driving this E36. Jack is driving a compact. Uh, Mitch is driving this E46. First day drifting in 2023. Starting it off uh, here at Driftland. So looking forward to it. It seems very dry. Um, so we'll see how these cars go on the dry. But it is absolutely freezing cold. This weekend we're taking the Falcon S14 out to Watergrass Hill for a TS Drift Days. So just trying to get a, get a bit of seat time in uh, before things kick off. Because it's been quite a while since we drove last year. And uh, it's just been that time of the year where we're busy making all our plans. And uh, not so much time on track. So I'm excited to drive with the lads. No doubt there's going to be some close tandem and uh, I'm excited. Looking forward to that. Yeah. It's your second time drifting this year, is it? Uh, yeah. So you did the first round of the, the series. Yeah. Connor, yeah. your first time drifting this year or not? Yeah. It's, my, it's my first. Huh? Oh yeah, you did the show run. Oh. Red Bull. Nothing better than driving some basic cars. The only thing it's going to be probably grippy out there. It is a Yeah. I don't even know what's in my pink, pink machine. Pink dinosaur. What's your chest? Not the pink. Let's have some fun.
That boy is good crack, isn't it? Yeah. Very good. And it's a Troy. It's actually better. The cars are better in the Troy than I expected. 18 psi, 200 horsepower. Oh. Oh, he's leaving though. Yeah. Very good crack. Took a few runs to uh, get the feel of this girl. Uh, we moved, put a different steering wheel in it, and uh, now we can actually reach it nicely. Really good times chasing Jack and Connor, and we're all swapping around, uh, putting a few marks in each other's cars. No big damage yet. They're all surviving. But, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much again, Neil. Katie yeah, Customs man. taking care of us always. And uh, the men for the BMWs. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs>
Shop today. Michael's on holidays this week, so we're doing a few bits and pieces. Uh, we're in Watergrass Hill last weekend with this car for like a final fun day out, uh, double checking the, the final version of the Wise Fab front mount, which you can see here clearly E46 front mount rack from a BMW on a Nissan, and uh, it's all a bit dirty now, but car has been stripped at the end of the season. Uh, we'll refresh the engine, my brother will do that, uh, strip the Samsonis transmission, check that. Uh, Mikey is getting to the back of the car. How are you, Mikey? Not too bad now. Look at the haircut in him. Where'd you get your haircut? Uh, Turkish barbers in Mallow. Shout out to Tariq. Tariq, good man. Yeah. Looked after me too. Yeah. Um, so yeah, getting the back of this car pulled apart because obviously we gave it the quick repair in... Poland after our crash in Germany. So our bars back here are a bit damaged. So we're gonna cut off the frame, um, build up a new one, straighten everything perfectly. Mikey's gonna give it a lick of paint. Yeah. He's good at that. Yeah, good yeah. so she'll be nice and fresh again before we get into it this season. Um, what else? So we're, we're kind of stripping this, gonna get it out of the way, um, cut the back of it off. Uh, straighten up a few things and then we'll be getting back into the other S14, the original, this car, the original S14. Uh, Mikey's after actually repainting the whole thing inside. Um, we were already, before Mikey started working here, the underneath was all painted and under the bonnet, so Mikey painted the inside, all the roof, all the body kit. So we're going to be assembling that car very soon. What else is going on? We got another car here underneath the S15, which uh, we'll be working on at some point. But we have no exact plan for it yet, but we have it. We'll talk about that more when we, when we do get into it. But yeah, it's just a time of the year that we're planning everything. A hell of a lot going on. Uh, tomorrow, we're going to be testing a track where I haven't been to in a very long time, so it's uh, going to be very exciting to 
to show you more on that. So we'll be recording that. That'll be probably in a video next week. Uh, but this week's video is mainly our driving in Driftland and the few shots that we got from driving the S14 in Watergrass Hill last week.